or better. Meantime, game one of our double dip here on TNT. Jason Tatum and the Celtics, KD and the Suns. And KD came out with 15 in the first quarter on seven of eight shooting, but only had five on two of 11 the rest of the game. Booker pulling up. Early seven point lead. Apparently, I'm not allowed to come come in on the Suns. Why not? Because they be killing me back home when I don't say everything they want me to say. What would they like Feel, to say? You have to have the freedom here on this show. It's a right. safe Let me tell you something. I don't give a damn you. what these people think. I'm going to say what I want to say. Shout out to Dan Bickley, my boy. Him and business Vince. <laughs> okay. Yusuf Nurkic gets the rebound. Bo Bo, go get that cereal, Eric! Nurkic, 20 rebounds on the night. You, you know what You know what the problem I see? What? With, with Phoenix? Is that they don't get any baskets in the paint when they need a tough basket. But they don't ever get easy baskets. Yeah, that's they need my a biggest tough, problem. When they need a tough basket, it's perimeter. Yeah, it's always. That's what I'm saying. They, that's why I oh, keep saying they need a point guard. They don't get any easy <laughs> baskets. Derek White clearing the way and uh, Jalen Brown they don't get no stops either. And Al Horford, uh, six threes on the night. The Celtics went 25 for 50 from out there. Jalen Brown, a 37-point night, his 14th game of Damn, at least 30. Look at Al. No poor Zingas tonight. Oh, give me that. Dunk it. And don't get back on defense. Ooh, look at Jalen Brown. Oh, yeah, we up 18. We can celebrate, Ernie. Point. We ain't got to get back. We up 18. And uh, 127 to 112 is your final score. The Celtics now 30 and one when they shoot 50%. They're nine and two since the All-Star break, best in the East. Fast break points in this game, 24 to eight in favor of the Celtics who have won eight in a row on, on their floor. After the game, Frank Vogel, the question posed kind of comparing where his sons are with where the Celtics are. We're just not quite where they are yet. Okay, but that's a key word, yet. You know, we're going to keep growing. We're going to keep getting better. We're in our first year together. You know, those two guys have been together eight years or so. And obviously, Joe's doing a great job, you know, taking the mantle with it. Um, but we're going to get where they're at. Brown puts an exclamation point on it. Oh, and you've got a head coach. Wow. He stepped on the floor trying to block a shot attempt of a player. I'm not sure I've ever seen that in Joe Mazzula. I saw a guy going in to try to get a shot and he hadn't made one. I didn't want him to feel good about himself going to the bench. One of the biggest pet peeves is just, you know, thinking that a guy's just going to get a free shot. It's just not the way it works. Did you see Joe try to block Rice? No, I didn't see that, but that that, that sounds like Joe Mazzula. If the guy, like, keeps trying to shoot, like, Joe will just keep playing defense, like, He'll take it as far as he needs to. That's who Joe is. So when he did, I wasn't caught off guard. I, ex I expect him or one of the coaches to do that. Um, you know, I love Joe for Joe. <laughs> Just when you think you've seen everything. I would have pump faked him and elbowed him at this. Somebody should have knocked him. the hell out of Joe. I <laughs> shook Joe up. <laughs> he tried to come out that one, man. Joe <laughs> up. Hey, listen, I... I Ain't no coach guard me on, ever. Man. Stop that, man. <laughs> ever. <laughs> like, yo, Shaq, ever. That, that's, like, like, ah, that's, like a fan, that's like a fan coming out the stands. No, you that's get, not like a fan. You should be able to whoop the hell out of but him. But that's not like a fan. <laughs> nope. He, dude, I wish he would try to block my shot. <laughs> hell no. Hell no. <laughs> Y'all know better. <laughs> Kenny. <laughs> Come on, Kenny. Uh, 1990, uh, Charles. No, that would have not have been a good idea. Thank you. Come you, on, man. You Joe Mazzola Danny. wouldn't have tried to block your shot. He shouldn't have tried to block anybody's shot. Yeah. I mean, he didn't want anybody like he doesn't right right so when you're feeling good about himself what was he over nine or something he was, like he that was up for up 20 at <laughs> ernie listen, i know man, I I know. Not, i'm not defending it i'm just kind of painting the picture <laughs> There you go. He and he, he actually had full extension. Nice closeout. That's a pretty good closeout. Come though, on, Joe. man. Yo, uh, I would have shook Joe up. <laughs> I'd have been like, I would have hesitated him. Hey, man. I would have hesitated him and let him jump and then shot it and looked at him. Come on, man. I would have knocked the hell out of Joe. I'm not going to lie. I would have hit the hell. I would have hit him. It would have been. If he, if he had pump fate and Joe just oh, flew no, by. Oh, man. I would have so always shot him. Because I'm going to tell you why I'm, I, I don't like it. What if. 
He stepped on his ankle. Stepped on his ankle uh, and hurt himself badly. Yeah, but it, you can't do that. Come on, man. But you can't be on the floor doing that. Come on, you can't. You should have knocked the hell out of him. It's hilarious. That is hilarious, though. <laughs> Give me a little Eastern Conference. Jack, has a coach ever tried to block anything? Or no, they knew better. Eastern, okay. Eastern Conference standings, if you oh, would. So the Celtics, God. they clinch a playoff spot because Philadelphia lost. Uh -oh. I know a lot of you are wondering, Army. hey, do you think the Celtics will clinch a playoff spot? Well, I just took his. Ah, ah, ah. Not pulling anything. Uh, the hard. Uh, cannot beat the Celtics in the first round. You know, it's interesting. Uh, it's interesting. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. Wow. I might write that. No, what's interesting, Chuckster? You know, Kenny... Look at Philadelphia falling now that, into that, the play. That's what, I, that's what I'm getting ready to say. You know, Kenny here. talked a little bit about it. I think it's going to be very difficult on Joel to just come back and try to play. Because, he, he, like I say, he's got a bad leg, so he probably ain't been, uh, hasn't been able to do any conditioning. Kenny seemed to think he can do it. But man, uh, that's the that's the that's the that's the number one question in my mind: Is Joel done for the season, or he coming back? Yep. Ten and twenty-two again, as we said. Yeah, they're they're, they're without without Embiid yeah. as they lose in Milwaukee tonight, one fourteen to one oh five. Oh, we got some more social going on here. There's uh, there, what what can there be stuff to comment on from from this show?